Everybody, what's going on? It's uh, Matt Holmes here with uh, BodySitEngineTraining.com and uh, InsaneMuscleGains.com. If you guys haven't checked out that website yet, um, if you want to get ideas and um, find out the program that I'm using, the guidelines, how I figured out what I'm eating, what I'm going to do to work out, and all my program, <coughs> excuse me, um, go to InsaneMuscleGains.com. You can check it out and uh, go from there. All right. Um, so what we got going on today is a lower body day. Uh, it's actually Saturday. Instead of doing Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I took yesterday off because I said I'm a little bit tired. I'm trying to just going on. Um, I'm trying to get over beat six still, so I just said, all right, cool. Listen to my body, which is a big key. Listen to yourself. There's points where, yeah, push yourself past that breaking point, but also if you're still getting over beat sick, make sure you're not doing it too much and uh, keeping yourself sick. So what we're doing today is um, heavy deadlifts. We're going to do uh, reverse lunges with the 75-pound sandbag and then... Um, we're gonna do uh, calf raises, and then uh, kind of leave a little bit open at the end. Make it, you know, mix it up a little bit. Probably throw in a little bit of, you know, maybe some extra little bodybuilding stuff with some curls or something like that, you know, and uh, figure it out from there. You know, kind of leave the end of it a little bit more freestyle because I just get tired of the same old, same old thing. So kind of want to switch it up. So all right, here we go. All right, everybody. So what we got here next are the um, sandbag front squats and uh, or uh, not front squats reverse lunges so I'm gonna run you through the form right here while Luke's doing it Luke step back farther with that back foot you just see he's keeping his upper body upright hold the bag up a little bit higher as high as you can get those elbows up there you go back farther big steps back there you go that's better good step back farther with that right foot it's only the right foot all right, good. And then what you notice what Luke didn't do, which what he should have done, but he doesn't listen ever, is squat down at the very end. Don't ever just put the weight down. Squat down with the deadlift with it, deadlift it back down. Same thing with kettlebell sandbags, same way you picked it up. Squat it down, cleaned it, squat back down, then drop it down. Just protect your lower back. All right, guys. Hey, everybody, what's going on? So I'm going to run you through the uh, deadlift right now while Luke's doing his so I can kind of show you guys some form stuff. So. All right, go for it. As you can see, he's keeping that back pretty flat, keeping that natural arch in it. He's sitting back really, really far. Your butt should be back a little bit farther than when you're doing a squat because the weight in front of you is going to keep you from uh, tipping backwards. Keep that weight on your heels. You see he comes back down, touches, pauses for a quick second, and then comes back up. You know, you want to make sure you get that full extension, come all the way down. Because again, if, remember, it's a deadlift when the weight's not stopping. You're not really fully doing the lift how you should. So come all the way down, pause it for about a half second, and come up as fast as you can with keeping that form nice and tight without rounding your shoulders over and, uh, you know, swinging your uh, butt in and coming up on your toes. Stay on those heels. You know, um, one quick little thing you guys can do is uh, when you come up and you are lifting heavy, some people say, keep looking straight ahead. I like tilting my chin up just a little bit because it just gets me going and I just power through it as good as I can. All right, man. Hey, everybody, what's going on? It's Matt again. So what we got going on next after we did our uh, reverse lunges, we're doing um, heavy, uh, well, not too heavy, actually. Uh, 45 on each side with the Olympic barbell um, on the back loaded, doing um, calf raises just straight off the ground. You can see Luke's just getting started right now. And then we're taking the kettlebell right here which is the uh, 20 kilo and we're doing um, 10 swings a hand to hand so five each and then we're gonna do uh, like I said we're throwing some bodybuilding today so we're gonna do uh, uh, easy curl with uh, pretty good uh, almost like concentration curls the best we can of uh, leaning over letting our arms just hang and curling up no cheat curls today so it's gonna be a little bit lighter and then we're done all right